Hey everybody, this is Nick with Rogue Overland. If you're new to the channel, we put out a lot of information about outdoor and off-road adventuring. So if that's something that you're into, smash that subscribe button. In this video, we're gonna be showing you several different overland or car camping setups so you can get an idea of different ways that you can get out and adventure and see if you think that one of them or even small ideas from each one of them will work well for you. Hey everybody, this is Sean. I drive Beardo the FJ. And uh, currently we're here to talk to you tonight about the Goose Gear Sleep System that I utilize. They developed and built a platform system for the FJ to mount the rear with all their slides, fridge mounts, and drawers. It's got a ton of cubbies in there. Basically all my gear storage occurs uh, beneath. And then my fridge sits there. And actually, <clears throat> not entirely sure if that was their original intent, uh, but I, I actually sleep out of the FJ. The seat goes forward in the front as much as you can, and I put a, actually a bubble rope on the floor there, and then a blanket, and my pillow sleeps great right there, and there's plenty of room. Currently, underneath all the storage, I keep all my spares, CVs, first aid kits, extra water bottles, tons of TP that's in shortage right now, and uh, I've been eyeing it for a couple years. Didn't think I could quite pull the trigger on the setup. Uh, it ultimately fit the bill, and we reached out to them. I purchased the setup and I have loved it for the last part of about nine months to a year. It's been great. Hey, what's up? Here at the big uh, Rogue Overland thing. Um, I just wanted to give you guys a little heads up on what I'm camping with over here. It's a Shift Pod 2 with the uh, annex, I guess you would call it. You could actually connect two of these big Shift Pods together. The reason I love this is because I got two girls, with, well, three girls, my wife and my two chil almost grown children. So we need a big space for all the things that keep them warm. So this works perfect for us. Love the shift pod, keeps us warm, and uh, it's easy to put up and set down. So that's another big good thing that uh, we like to do. But yeah, this is kind of how, uh, how we camp. Couldn't be in a better place and uh, couldn't be with a better pe bunch of people. Just want to remind you that if you want to help support the channel, smash that subscribe button, hit the like button, throw a comment below, share the video with your friends, all those things help to extend the reach of this video. You can also check out some of our Rogue Overland swag at rogueoverland.com backslash shop. And purchasing something there just helps us continue to produce more great content for our audience. We were always tent campers all summer, every weekend. And we found this and it's much more comfortable and I love it. The thing we were looking for in a camper that we could overland in was something that was fast set up and fast breakdown. The thing we like about the habitat is that this gives us a patio area that's shaded from the sun. Perfect. And this was a ready-made vehicle for us. Um, other than that, it's super comfortable. The Nemo tent, the canvas, uh, wax canvas Nemo tent is super quiet and it actually is insulated so it keeps us really warm and we also sleep with um, 12 volt heating pads yes. um, tons of space lots of lighting options um, put an s-pod in it to control the lights from the back and up in the front and uh, we feel fortunate that we were able to get this from andre at uh, at overland it fits our needs perfectly so as you know, nobody's perfect. When recording the rooftop tent setup on this sweet Tacoma, I totally forgot to hit the record button. So I'm gonna throw up some cool footage of this Tacoma, just so you can see some cool stuff. And I'm gonna read for you what it was that they said. So this is regarding a Cascadia Vehicle Tents rooftop tent setup. We waited quite a while, we waited quite a while before choosing to go with a rooftop, rooftop tent. After seeing how well CVT tents held up on our friends' trucks, and we decided on the Mount Hood. The setup and teardown is quicker than I thought was possible, which was great for our first trip to Colorado, where we changed camp every night. The Mount Hood had everything we needed until we started bringing our children on our adventures. We decided that we needed a larger setup and went with the Mount Shasta with an annex for our family of four. We got it just in time for spring break when we camped along the Pacific coast 
from North Cal to SoCal over the course of a week. The Mount Shasta made the trip a breeze and protected us from the unpredictable April weather we found ourselves in. I hope you enjoyed the information in this video. Please remember to smash that subscribe button, find us on all social media avenues at Rogue Overland, and we'll see you on the trail.